Right. And it just gives a nice balance, because you serve it cold. Okay. Okay. So, you pass so, me the, so the good clothes I've put in here. Yes. And do you want the so, sugar as well? Um, sugar, please, yes. Okay. So, yeah. and how much of that is. And a bit of water. Go on. Quite a quarter of a bottle. Okay. Perfect. That's it. Um, yeah, perfect. A little bit of sugar in there. Okay. That's okay. a quarter of a bottle. Almost. Like that. so. Okay. Oh, I, I like the scientific so. measurement there. Yeah. Okay. You can do it by eye when you've done it enough times. Yeah. And then you can finish it at the end with a touch more sugar. That's so, why you are an expert ah. chef and I'm a cat handed amateur. Right, so this goes in like so. Okay. All cold, and you bring the whole lot up to the boil, okay? Okay. Perfect. Right. Now, is there anything I can do to right, help you on here? We're going to shave the fennel. Can you do that for me? I don't. Do you trust me? Ooh, did I teach you how to eat a mandolin? <laughs> no, you didn't. Wrong I was guy. off the mandolin master Wrong time, class. wrong place. Okay. Yeah, just half it. Take out the outside leaves. Yeah, I will. Uh, I will. I'll do that. Inside. Okay, sorry. Just ask me to pass something. Now, are you going to open those? I'm going to open these now, yeah. Now, these are not our native oysters, are they? Those are rock oysters. No, to, to cook native oysters would be a terrible waste. And also, it's a wrong consistency, I think, for a dish of this sort. It is. You, we use the uh, West Mersey rock oysters. Yeah. Because they're more sturdy. They go slightly larger. Okay. And you lightly fry them, and, and it holds up very well. Now, when you're opening an oyster, how do you how do you do it? Well, I use the cloth. Yeah. Because then, if it does slip, yeah, it goes into the cloth. Not into your hands. Yeah, exactly. Okay. And you just put the tip of the oyster knife oh. into there. Yes. And very... then twist. Oh. It's always great to see an expert at work. I try this, it takes me hours to open each oyster. Ah. And I usually end up covered in blood as well. See, you okay. just twist it and then it pops out like that. And look at that oyster, so big. That's beautiful, lovely plump oyster. oyster. You can smell the sort of, the, the, some marine essence can, of it, can't you? you? That, that sea saltiness, yeah. Okay.